Welcome to this uh, Windows and Computer channel. And I wanted to uh, just share one little blocker that a lot of people might have. And it's been going on for a while that this could be a potential problem on machines with Windows 11. So um, Intel has a Intel SSD or smart sound technology driver that is available for some machines. You can see if you have that by right clicking on the start button, going to the device manager, and in here, go down to what is sound, video, and game controllers. Here, you will see your sound devices. If you see the Intel SSD or smart sound uh, device in here, that means that you might be, uh, it might be the reason for you to actually not either upgrade to Windows 11 if you're on Windows 10, because there is a blocker around this for Windows 10 users. So if you haven't seen Windows 11, um, updating to the latest driver from Intel for this would be a good idea. And if you're on Windows 11 and have been having some blue screens, of that, or actually they were black screens and they're black to, back to blue screens now. Uh, this could be the case if you have an older driver. It seems that there's an incompatibility with older drivers of the Intel Smart Sound technology and Windows 11. Now Microsoft and Intel have both confirmed that this is the case and that some devices and some PCs have had some crashes in blue screens because of this. Now, the fix is to update the driver to the latest version that is available. So it's important to check that out uh, and download it either from the manufacturer of your PC or you can, uh, of course, go into the driver in, uh, in the, um, the computer and, um, you know, check driver and check update drive, see if there's an update here. But also, you can uh, go to the Intel website and check out for a driver for this. But it seems that the Intel Smart Sound technology for some is actually breaking Windows 11. And uh, this is fixed in the latest drivers. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.